What up, it's Melvin7 here and today I'm bringing you whatever uh, Thursday content you have, likely just marquee matchups I would imagine. Uh, so we've got a new uh, newcomers challenge for a 75 plus rare player, pretty dead there to be honest, uh, it's untradeable, um, I have already done it as you can see, <laughs> um, but yeah I mean minimum bronze, you know, it's it's whatever. Um, I don't know what other SBCs there are, but I I, I already had this one pre-done because, yeah, what's the point in dawdling with this? But, uh, yeah, we've got one silver player, two rares. It's all bronze. I, I mean, it's going to it's gonna set you back about 2k, but it's still an L because you're just getting one player that's rare gold, 75 plus, so meh. Pretty meh there, but we'll see uh, what marquee matchups is. Um, wait, is it? It's not there. We've got UEFA Champions League. Nine, nine SBCs there. Complete challenges themed around UEFA Champions League to earn an untradeable 50k pack. Okay, that's pretty decent, uh, I imagine. But there's nine things. Um, have they forgot about marquees? Wait, where was... Where's that Champions League thing? Oh, there. It's on leagues. Oh, it's a new league SBC. Right, let's have a look. <laughs> Okay, well the packs back looked really good, apart from the untradeable Prime Electrum and Rare Mixed, everything is tradable, but, oh my god, UEFA Champions League Commons and Rares are going to go through the fucking roof, wow, so everything needs 95 chemistry, oh my god, oh my god, I love the idea of this, but just because of how the market is, is this repeatable? Or is this just, if it's, a, yeah, it is. Okay, it's, it's repeatable. Ooh, they, I don't know. I don't know. I mean, the community is obviously going to make these cards about 8K a pop after this. Um, so, I mean, it's probably going to cost 200K to do the entire thing. But in terms of being repeatable and having a reason, uh, you know, to use that 81 plus SBC, I wonder if they've released any other SBCs in terms of that. But let's see if I can do any of this. Uh, so if we use a Champions League rare. As you can see, I've got tons. Um, whether I can get 95 chemistry, though, uh, remains to be seen. I don't think so, to be honest. I don't even have a goalkeeper. Oh, I mean, I can use Maguire and Tomori there. But yeah, I mean, nine squads, eight of them need these Champions League cards and some of them don't. Um, I think it was the last one, wasn't it, for a rare Electrum. It's a bit weird sticking that on this, but you just need a PSG player, four rare players. I'll do this one. I even if you're not going to do the whole set, definitely do this one. Uh, an 80 rated team is cheap as fuck. You can use the same league. Um, you just need one PSG or Bayern Munich player, so I'm going to complete that. It's a tradable 30k pack, and you know, tradable packs are like gold dust on this game uh, when it comes to SBCs, so I would definitely recommend you complete this one, 100%, uh, even if you're not going to do the entire set. Um, but yeah, uh, in terms of the rest of what is out, I don't know really. I don't know, like the rest of the set... Um, yeah, I'm throwing in some of these OP cards because I'll pack them again anyway. Um, obviously, I need a PSG player, which I think I've already put in. So it should be fine here. I'm not going to use Champions League cards, of course. But we'll see what else I've got in there. Uh, just to, you know, finish this off. I don't, I don't know if this will be enough rating, to be honest. Because it's 80. I might have to put someone else in. Do we have... Hmm... What rating are we on there? 78? It could be. Could be. Oh, yeah, it is. Right, now I just need the chemistry. Well, one came off. <laughs> oh, wow. Um, you are taking the piss. I can't be just one chemistry off. Really? I don't want to use the Champions League cards, of course. Kakuta? Use him? That's not going to help, is it? No, that drops the chem. So, oh, because I've bought him. Um, What else did I have there? Renato Sanchez, I would prefer not using him. And again, that's not going to boost it up. Um, I mean, I'll just go and buy a fucking League One striker. It'll be easier. But yeah, definitely do this segment for a 30k pack. 
We'll see if there's any objectives as well. But yeah, in terms of the rest of it, it just depends how, how crazy people are going to go uh, for the market. Like, I can see this going, as I say, 200k for all these Champions League cards. It's kind of like the Cannonball one, where, you know, you need a bunch of Cannonball players to do this. Right, I'll use Toko Kambe if, you know, it's going to let me put him in. Right, there you go. Uh, let's see how much this dude is. Yeah, he's cheap. Right, nice. We can get him for like 800 coins. 700 coins? 750? Yeah, there we go. Cool. Okay, that'll do. So yeah, I'm going to I'm gonna complete that one. Uh, I might have a video on this um, a bit later on or tomorrow just to, you know, see, see if I can do it, uh, how much it's going to cost, that sort of thing. Let's see if there's any other SBCs because, of course, you've got the 81 plus for the Champions League card, but... Do we have anything else? I don't think so. Of course, you can use commons too, which is good. I didn't check how many commons I've got. But yeah, there's there's definitely just this UCL upgrade. I'll check the upgrade SBCs. Yeah, there's still only that. Right, we'll check um, what objectives there are. But yeah, I, I like it. I just know for a fact the community is going to make this cost about 200k, as I say, to complete. Uh, right, there's no objectives. Is there milestones? Nope, not by the looks of it. And is there a new team objective? Probably not. Nope. Okay, so there's just that. Uh, I, I'd say it's a win. Uh, the chemistry is probably a little bit high. I think that's harsh, but at least it's tradable rewards. So even if it is a 200k spend or however much, it might be a lot more, to be honest. Uh, 200k might be conservative. I don't know. Um, I'll, I'll check if Footbin has any solutions, but yeah, you're getting some decent packs back. You're probably getting in excess of 200k back in terms of packs, and they are tradable, most of them. So you've got good chances of making profit. Um, it's far better than the other two SBCs, though, the, the League SBCs anyway. And there we go. Rare Electrum gives us absolutely nothing, just what you want. Um, but we do get a Foden, which, let's have a look, see how much he is. <laughs> oh, just look at that, man. If you've got any UCL tradable cards, just sell them. Sell them in the hype. Uh, you can see he's going for like 4k at the minute. So if you take that as an average, 3 to 4k per card, um, you're looking at 45k per team, 9 teams per oh. You're looking at maybe 400k for the SBC. Oof. Just let it settle down. Let it settle down. It's there for a month uh, and it's repeatable. So uh, I don't know. I don't know. I, I think it's a dub. I just... Uh, there's certain parts of it that makes me feel like, hmm, L. What do you think?